Peter Vela was off filming Naked Lunch. Yes, I think he got the better <laughs> offer there, I think. Um, he must have been shocked when he turned up and Naked Lunch wasn't what he expected. <laughs> <laughs> he turned up, in, turned up in the nude with his picnic He turns up around David Cronenberg's house and goes, so, oh, I'm ready. Oh, I'm ready. That's not what this film is, Peter. <laughs> this isn't <laughs> what I expected. Uh, uh, Who's hungry for sausage sandwiches? <laughs> Yeah, it's not about nudity or lunch. Or about lunch. <laughs> That's just false advertising. Although, although there is something known as a black meat operation in it. <laughs> Which is a very niche kind of film. Eye opening. I've seen some examples of. The thing is, you say about 80s and 90s and all that sort of thing, I've got no, I didn't grow up with any fondness for Transformers at all. Mm-hmm. None, so I wasn't that bothered. Yeah, I was more Ghostbusters man myself. <laughs> I'm a Ghostbusters man, he <laughs> says, in his smoking jacket, age six. I was too busy being into like, my little thing and Ninja Turtles. Yeah, yeah, Ninja Turtles, Ghostbusters, that, that was me when I was good. If she doesn't want to do anything as empty as Transformers, <laughs> Ninja Turtles. <laughs> <laughs> Ninja Turtles on the other hand. Yeah. Use Hollywood films in particular to, fe- to feature Japanese companies, maybe? Yeah, I'm just grasping at straws. No, that's fine. Well grasped. Um, I'm still trying to find something. We'll, 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 we'll take whatever padding we can get. Like. Yeah, this... <laughs> it's funny you mentioned Die Hard. Should we chat about that? <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm granted. I, I, I was yeah. trying to, you know, off air, I was trying to forge a link with, with Akira. Again, it was like, it was um, 1988. So, again, similar to Die Hard, it's something that was made many years prior. Neither have seen Akira, we established. So, you could just, like, give us a quick pot synopsis of that. <laughs> <laughs> so, well, that's quite lengthy and labyrinthine. Labyrinth? Has anyone seen that? <laughs> no, I haven't seen Labyrinth. <gasps> have you not? That's a really good film. I can recommend it. Why? Right. That's a real classic. I think it might be on Netflix. I didn't fancy it when I was a kid, so I've never got round to it as an adult. What? Oh my god. I only saw The Rocketeer about it. You should check it months. out. Play if I haven't been. But then there's a lot of films yeah, that are well known that I haven't seen, so. What? Not watching it, it, it's, it's worth it for uh, David, pa- uh, David Bowie's uh, stuff crotch, though. <laughs> What? <laughs> he he wear, wears very tight uh, like lycra pants and his uh, his groin area is rather enlarged. <laughs> it's quite it's quite tightly packed in there. And they sold this to kids? Yes they did. Yeah. <laughs> when you said stuffed crotch, I kind of heard it as stuffed cross because we were talking about toilets. <laughs> so I thought like is there a ch- Literally a te- literally a cheesy villain. <laughs> well, Dave, I imagine it is a, that as well, but 